It's time to choose your lineup, brought to you by Jameson. Join our unofficial call to try to get pro football to Dublin. Visit jamesonsports.com for more. Matthew, how about four flex picks for week one? Yeah, borderline guys that I think you can use this week, and that includes Baker Mayfield, who last year, uh, last week, obviously, 349 and three touchdowns. Um, uh, sorry, last year, I should say, 349 yards and three touchdowns in that playoff loss at Detroit. He plays the Lions again this week as well. Remember, the Lions allowed the second most passing yards in week number one. This game is the highest over under in week two. J.K. Dobbins looks all the way back, and now he gets a Carolina Panthers defense that gave up 132 and two rushing yards, two rushing touchdowns in week number one. Uh, other side of the ball, um, sorry, in the same game, but uh, other side of the offense, Lad McConkey. Uh, we like Dobbins as a running back. We like McConkey as a wide receiver against the Panthers. He had a 28% target share from Justin Herbert, despite playing fewer snaps than Quentin Johnson and Josh Palmer. And how about Colby Parkinson for the Rams? Again, we keep talking about the fact that Puka Nakua is injured. His absence, Puka's absence, opens up a 29% target share. No tight end ran more routes in week number one than Colby Parkinson. I have him as a top 15 play this week. C.J. Stroud lands in Matthew's top 10 quarterback ranks this week as the Texans host Caleb Williams and the Bears in Houston Sunday, 7 Eastern on NBC and Peacock. Hey, it's Matthew Berry from NBCSports.com and RotorWorld.com, and I want to thank you so much for watching whatever it is you just watched, or if nothing else, being too lazy to click out of the autoplay after this video started, after whatever it is you actually wanted to watch finished. But now that you're here, I'd like to take a moment here to ask you respectfully, respectfully now, okay? I'm asking you respectfully to subscribe to the NFL on NBC YouTube channel. You'll get the latest Roto World fantasy news headlines, all sorts of great shows, including my own fantasy football happy hour. So go subscribe now. Again, I'm asking respectfully.